I'm here with Kurt Covert from Smirk and Dagger. He is going to be showing us Wooly Mammoth. Kurt, welcome to the show. Hey, thanks so much. Hey, tell us all about this. You betcha. All right, so uh, Wooly Mammoth is a, it's kind of a guts game. where you, It's a think, double think kind guts? of a game where... Guts, did you say? Yes, mm. indeed. Well, you're a tribe of cavemen, okay. and you're trying to feed your, uh, your family by knocking woolly mammoths off the edge of a cliff. Okay. Thereby, you know, getting meat for that, uh, for that fine thing. Um, what you're trying to avoid, however, is you want to avoid landing in a tar pit, okay. you want to avoid being trampled by a mammoth, and you certainly don't want to fly off the edge of the cliff with the mammoth itself. But that and is that, a glorious death. Well, and it happens a lot. Yes. <laughs> if you're so, going to go, yes. go with the mammoth. So the reason why uh, this happens, and kind of the fun of the game, is that you are trying to quickly get out of sync with people so that they are in peril and not you. Uh -huh. So everyone has the exact same set of movement cards. Okay. Uh, and they range from minus three all the way up to four. All right. And, um, yep. Just to make sure everybody sees these. Yep. All right, there we go. There Ooh. you go, yep. All right, there we go. So, did you put it on that down? All right. Now, Everyone's going to choose one, put them face down, and then everyone will reveal. Okay. But it's not just the one that you played. It's all of them combined that govern how we all move. Oh. oh. This just got ugly. Yeah. So, for example, uh, the Timid Tribe, um, if we look, it's four, three, seven, minus three, back to four, six. Everyone has to move six. Okay. This is going right over the edge with their mammoth. <laughs> so they will score a meat because they did, they did get a mammoth, okay. but they've lost one of their four people. Um, but because they did score a mammoth, their board will stretch, and now they have to go farther to find more mammoth. Ah. And same goes around the table. So, uh, oh, that is ridiculous. Yeah. Look at It's oh, very cool. Oh, you are now my hero. Now, the green team played two take break. Okay. So they're forcing everyone forward two. Okay. But because they played take break, they are not moving at all. So they have planned on being trying to, you know, getting thrown over. Mm -hmm. And this guy fell for it. He's went over. This guy's safe. He went six. But he's safe. So now next turn I'm trying to remember what what did everyone else play? What mm -hmm. can I now play? So it, Oh because yes. you're trying to figure out and count the cards. Exactly. Uh -huh. Now, then someone else will play something like Charge. Adds one to everyone's movement, but now once the cavemen are done moving, the mammoths get their turn. So you draw a card from the Charge deck, four. That's now a problem. Uh, one, two, three, four, he gets crushed, so there are a lot of ways to die in this game. <laughs> <laughs> um, unless, of course, you had played a minus three run away. Oh, then he would back up. Actually, what would happen is he can duck and cover and jab him as he goes through and gain the meat. Gain the meat. So it's it's all trying to figure out what are they going to do, what am I going to do to try to put them in peril and keep myself safe and drive a mammoth over the edge. Mm -hmm. um, everyone ends up also having a special ability. Okay. Um, it's a, you know, eat this or that, whenever you want to, and then it's exhausted. And when you lose a caveman, then you get it back. Um, now, the real trick, though, about playing your cards is, at the end, you know, you're going to start running out of options. All these get played, they're in your personal discard pile, and you're like, oh, I don't have what I need, or I'm about to run out. The only way to get your hand back is to spend one of your hard-earned meat tokens. So you're going to win either by holding six of them or being the last tribe standing, which, quite honestly, is often the case. Um, that's, that's amazing. So, you know, you work so hard for this meet, and then and you have get, to, and the they only have to, way that you can get your cards back. Yeah. And, and oftentimes, if, if you know what you're holding and you suspect that they are going to be able to drive you off the cliff, you're like, all right, I have to pay a meet, take up all your cards again. Right, you right. Know. Or you, you try to gauge, oh, maybe I can outlast them. Exactly. Maybe I can. You know, it's, it's, there's a, a phenomenal balance there. Yeah. And then this is just... And that's fun. And you can see, oh. like, as you pull that out, you know... It there's might, more tar pits. You know, so you might have a double tar pit, which is kind of hard to avoid. Mm -hmm. um, now, there are modifiers on some of the cards. So it's four, but just for me personally, I have another plus one. Or it could be a little minus one. 
So oftentimes when you're near tar pits, you want to play things that give you a little minus or plus just so you can try to sidestep, mm -hmm. you know, when pe other people don't, don't see that you plan for it. Um, it's, it's got a little bit of a pokery feel yeah. in terms of like yeah. trying to reason out. You're trying yeah. to say, mm, I think he still has this, yeah. but I don't know what that one has. And then you're, you're sitting there with what you got. Right. And do I really want to play this now or do I want to drop this? Exactly. Glorious. Yeah. Glorious. So it's a, it's a blast to play. It, it take, it's for two to four players and it takes about uh, 30, 40 minutes. Perfect. Perfect time. Yep. Great. Beautiful. I mean, the art's beautiful. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Hey, fantastic. Hey, thanks. Fantastic. And uh, so it's coming out. Well, it was supposed to be out here at the show. Okay. And there was a small production error that's going to set us back maybe a month. So okay. it looks so like it's going to be Gen Con? end of July and into Gen, Gen Con. We will definitely have them. All right. Yeah. Fantastic. Hey, everybody. It's going to be out in Je Gen Con. Wooly Mammoth, Schmirk and Dagger, Kurt Covert. Thank you so hey, much. Thank you. Fantastic. I love it. Beautiful. Make sure you check it out, and uh, we will see you soon.